Well, hello there, Shirley Rocks here. Welcome back to RimWorld. I've got problems. So, where do I start? Gore and the rest of them are still coming back. And they are there, they're, they're about um, 0.3 days out. So they should be home soon. So, that's not the problem. The problem is, oh, oh chickens. Chickens are a problem. I've used up loads of medicine on them and they've decided they do not want to be here anymore so yeah they've uh that one's got extreme blood rot and i think it was the first one oh it's not even there anymore i think i think it's definitely gone in the pot yeah there, there was another chicken but unless it's in here it was the yeah look this is the first one that died this was walter yeah that died from the um the the blood drop or maybe malnutrition i think it was the blood rot it died from but yeah they started drinking and it died and they've all left now apart from that one because that one doesn't want to go it's unconscious at the moment <laughs> but now we're on to the problem yeah mechanoids we've got the hive which has landed right near my base and this if you remember is the one that was after the chickens but the chickens aren't here now, apart from one, and yet they're still here. So that we're gonna we're gonna try and do that in a bit. Um, what else have we got? Oh yeah, I, I mentioned briefly about um, Doc. Apparently, Doc is the lover of Saga, but it did it did mention something there. Mercenary Gunner Kazuya. That was the husband of Marine. So I think that's what's triggered Gore over the edge. So I'm trying to furiously get these traps finished because when them um, when them mechs come, it's going to be not fun. So I'm hoping to get as many traps as I can finished before I have to trigger them. And hopefully we're going to get the rest of the people back because I don't want to have to deal with this. Now, I did switch all my production to heal roots. I think I might just do one cycle of that and then we're going to go back to normal business i've tried to turn a lot of that, a lot of that off as well because we've been struggling with power so yeah we, we do need power i've not got any components though so we're a bit of a bit of an impasse oh we finished researching that as well i was wondering what to research next so i was thinking maybe doing a drill because I, I i want to know if i can get it says minerals and rocks I want to know if I can get other stuff, though. See, what does that do? I really want to get components. I don't know if you can get components from that sort of stuff, though. But I'm going to give it a go. Okay, finally the caravan has arrived. Oh, right. We need to get back to base. Now, I don't think these are going to go through it. Good. Because these have been so upset. Go... Uh, if you remember the end of the last episode, Gore was just raging, and the more I played it, Gore just returns, returns, and didn't want to join the colony. I ended up trying to persuade you to join me back. I ended up put, putting you as a prisoner, and I thought, no, what we'll do is we'll form a caravan and just hot foot it back here. So that's what we've done. So that's that's the reason that Gore is so upset. Apparently, Gore has another husband, which I didn't know about because you were. You were going out with Lover, and your husband was a mercenary. Ah, oh, this just blows my mind. The throne room is not impressive, though. It's only 116 out of 160, so we do need to work on that. Work on the other room as well for that other quest, but we need to we need to get rid of the mechs first. And we should have got a few components from that little, uh, that little uh, trip then, so hopefully we'll have a few components in our little compendium now. We got any? Have a look. I've got seven. Better than nothing, I suppose. I go on, go on all eat meals and try and be happy. Oh, Doc. Excellent. You're uh, one of the gang now. What are you actually good at then, Doc? I might leave you on automatic. I know I always leave someone on automatic and decide it's the worst thing ever, but we'll leave you on automatic and see what happens. I think you might be doing a bit of crafting by the look of it, or hauling. It's somebody's birthday. Oh no, it's your birthday, you've got a bad back, happy birthday. <laughs> that sucks, I'm making you work in a quarry to make it an even worse birthday. 
Right, how's the building coming on, guys? Guys and gals. Well, it's coming. Now, I would like to have a dedicated Smivy Smivy. I've not really got one at the moment. Who is actually really good at it? Gizabeth, are you a researcher, though? Army sniper. Wait a minute. Army sniper. Are you... Okay, we've got a few people doing this. I'm making shells at the moment. Making boom boom shells. Because we've got a massive... We've got ten. I reckon we can get a few rounds off on these. And try and cause a bit of a, a shenanigans with them. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Smoking flake. No, we do not want you doing that. So that must be one of these uh, containers, I guess. I don't even know why we've even got that. Yeah. Oh, no, 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 uh, no. We do not want that. In fact, let us flick this on. I'm going to add a bill to burn drugs, do forever. And in this, we're going to burn Luciferium, wake up. Oh, no, no, no. We want, I want to keep. Keep that, keep that, keep that. So we want to burn everything. Yeah, that's going to do. Right. Um, I need, I need to haul that or get rid of it. Right, smoking flake. No, you're not. Let's go and flick that switch instead. We're going to get rid of that flake because that, that's, that causes uh, addictions. Yeah, it's, it's it's very addictive. It, <laughs> it destroys lives, communities, and entire societies. So we want to get rid of that. So we're going to turn that on. And we are going to burn stuff. Right, burning drugs. Get rid of that evil flake. What was that? Something just went boom. Don't know what that was. That is going to wake up soon now. It's going to activate in 1.4 days. I don't want it to activate. Oh, look. This is interesting. Why is the... Uh... Why is this all blown up? How did that happen? Didn't say there was um, an explosion. Really weird. Wait a minute. Do you know I said I heard something? That is shooting at me. Why is that shooting at me? Right, okay then. Okay, okay, you play silly games, you get silly prizes. Right. You want to shoot at me? I'm going to shoot at you. Let us get back on this. Wow. Not like that. Right. Quick. Two arms, men. Okay, so we've got two choices. We can have a shoot for these things. Ooh, what's this? Mortar shield. So this is a whole shield, isn't it? Right, let's try... and do that. And... take off hold fire. Let's see if we can take this shield down. Right, how do I get that? Intercepts aerial projection. Ugh. How do we get the shield down then? Do we just shoot at it? I don't know if this will even work. I'm, I'm going to try and shoot inside the shield. Yeah, that didn't really seem to work, did it? This is probably a foolish idea. Right. Come on. We're gonna <laughs> we're gonna try and shoot this bit here. So 
I think I need a line of sight attack to do it. Oh, this is like the worst idea ever. Right, so we're gonna shoot in there. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna keep shooting in there. That's not really doing anything, is it? <laughs> I'm hoping to disable it. Oh come on! If I go if I go a bit to the right, is that going to be a better shot? There you go. That's going to be a bullseye. Come on. Right, we've stunned it. Now we need to run away. Turn off fire at will. Run, 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 run. Now I think the shield's going to be down now. So, great. Oh, look at this. This is, a, this is a trouble people get into. Look at this. You're trapped inside your own base. Deconstruct that. Get on that turret. Set the target as the shield. Right, you just run. I need a few people on these uh, guns now. So, go on that. Go is eating a meal. You can go on that one. And Army can go on that one. I don't think we've woken them up yet, though. Judging, judging what we're about to do, though, I think this might wake them up a little bit. Right. I don't trust this isn't going to wake the whole base up, so here we go. Yep. <laughs> That's definitely woke them up. Okay, if you want to get back into the base... So I did say about that alternative animal zone. Now, the reason I mentioned about that is because we need an alternative animal zone. So what I'm going to have to do is I've got my little zone over there. So I'm just going to get all my animals into that one zone just so we're a little bit safe. <gasps> They've summoned reinforcements. Where the heck is that shooting? I don't know, but it didn't go near me. Alright, we need to uh, get back to the base and try and deal with this. Okay. Be easy if I just selected everyone like this. And did everyone as draft. And stuck everyone in the one area. Apart from uh, Lover, you can stay in that area and Snook, so can you. Now, Doc, can you do violence? Yes, you can. So, we're going to give you a gun. Let us have a little look and see what guns we've got. So, we want something that's going to be good against those. So, I'm thinking maybe LMG. I mean, we have got EMP grenades. Could have EMP grenades, couldn't I? It's a really short um, distance on them, though. No. I'm going to give him an assault rifle. So, Doc, if you can come and grab that. Um, you're going to be shooting that thing there, so let us have you cowering behind that. Now you get inside because that scythe is coming for you. Back to base. Shut the door. Oh, look at that. The door shut. You have to go the long way. Right, you get into position. Getting all your firepower into position. Karen and Spartan, you've got the guns. You go there, you go there. Go. We're going to keep you back a little bit because I don't want anything bad happening to you. Redtail, if you can go out there. Gizabeth, so can you. Uh, Jones, we we'll might take you over there. Get a bit of cover over there. Okay, and Doc. 
kind to uh, test you out, you can come over there behind the sandbags. Okay, here they come. Now, hopefully those ones are going to go down pretty easy. The centipedes I really want to sort of thin out. So these are all just coming and coming and coming. Oh, can you, look at all these traps that aren't used though. That really does suck. Now we have got the opportunity of... Um, oh, look at that though. That's going to be shooting at us still, isn't it? Please don't say you just shot all my animals in that area. Let's rescue my panther. Uh, wh where are these going? I'm gonna, uh, surely I'm safer inside the building. I need, I need to uh, take down that turret, but I don't have a clue how I'm going to do it. Okay, the, the gang's all coming now anyway. So we need to start thinking about getting ready to do shooty shooty. Um, trouble is a lot of this stuff has got silly range, so... I'm going to have to have a group of people go and uh, manually attack that. So this might end up going over two episodes. So we're just going to see how far, how far these can be stopped. So we can, we can get that quite far into the tunnel. So we're going to start getting that ready. Okay, Panther, can you get treated? Not assigned to doctrine. Uh, let's do you a little bit of doctrine then. Let's get you tended. Okay, here they come. It's going to be the centipedes that go through, I think. Yeah, these are... Uh, Eichmann are pretty... Look at the health on that. One more trap and that one's going to be down. These things, though, they're going to be the pain givers. In fact, the centipede's going to overtake this. Oh, if you can run... Th Come on, if you can go through the traps first. That'd be much better. Because how much health is that going to take off? About 10% each time. Okay. Go on. Get wrecked. Come on, stun it, stun it, stun it. Nice. Oh. Well. Oh, look at that, another, another shell. Oh, no, 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 no. <gasps> um. <laughs> okay. I think I'm going to call that there for now. So that's a bit of a cliffhanger episode. Next episode, we're going to go and try and take on that base before it blows up my base with all its shells. So, whew, pretty exciting episode. Thank you for watching. See you again next time.